<laughs> Madaktari wanaitaka serikali kushirikiana nao kikamilifu kukabili janga la corona nchini. Katibu mkuu mpya wa KMPDU Dev Jatela anasema daktari wamekuwa mstari wa mbele tangu corona kuripotiwa nchini. My call to the national government is number one, they need to employ more healthcare workers to, to, to budget, increase the budget. That is the budget declaration. They increase the budget to 15% at least so that we can have a better healthcare system. We can have more doctors being employed in different facilities and also to push the, gov the county governments to implement the CBA for the doctors. As a new team that has come in, with our Monday that started on the 6th of May, first on our tray will be to appeal, first of all, that the disastrous health bill that is being sneaked into the National Parliament and the Senate be put on hold immediately. Wito wake unafuatia kuwepo kwa ofu ya wimbi la nene la virusi vya corona, akishikilia kuwa mchango maususu wa madaktari katu wa ufai kupuuzwa. There's been many issues in the county government and even in the national government. We have doctors who are working under UHC and doctors who are working in COVID, COVID centers have, have, have not been paid for more than four months. So these doctors, act, as they work, they don't, have, uh, they, they don't have their salaries. Secondly, these doctors have not been, they don't have cover, the compressive medical cover. So we see the situation that we used to have last year where the doctors are offering services are not able to get the, uh, the services that themselves they offer. There's another big thing of the shortage. There's a big shortage of healthcare workers in the country, especially the doctors. But this is artificial shortage that I think has been created. Where we have doctors who have graduated from the universities are in enmas outside in the, in the country, like more than 3,000. But then the county government and even the national has not employed these workers. Mkuu wa KMPDU amehimiza serikali ya kitaifa kwa kisha kuwa chanjo zinazo subiri wa zitalitu wa kabli ya kumalizika kwa juma la kuminambili kwani wa Kenya wingi na odumu wa afya hoja pato chanjo. Doses of vaccine that came recently were not enough for all the health, for everybody and then for the first dose. So many people are still are waiting for the second dose. What we want is that the government actually need to ensure that the second dose comes within timeline so that the 12 weeks that were meant are meant for them are actually implemented. Because then at that point every person that is the healthcare workers and even the one who have received it will get a maximum benefit from it. Hii anasema itaruhusu fanisi wake. Serikali za kaunti pia zinatakiwa kuangazia maslahi ya hudumu wa afya ili kurahisisha huduma zao kwa wananchi bila itilafu yoyote. Haya yanajiri huku taifa siku ya leo ilikirekodi maambukizi mengine mapya 267 ya virusi vya corona kati ya maambukizi hayo 237 ni wanaume 155 wakiwa ni wanawake. Jumla ya maambukizi haya ya virusi vya corona yamefikia 1165979 ila watu wengine 25 wameweza kufariki siku ya leo. Faith Anyula K24 Samoja